chick flicks. Hey, Giddy Giddy Giddy, how are you? Why is this floor wet? Did you have an accident? Well, that wouldn't be so strange. You are 18 years old, after all. Oh, God, you gotta be kidding me. Why is the air conditioner leaking? This isn't happening. This isn't happening. This isn't happening. All right, kids, come sit down. I gotta tell you something. All right, so listen. Um, we may have to cancel the Disney trip. Why? Because I think the air conditioner might be broken and we might have to... Ugh! If you see a bunch of water near your air conditioner, before you start canceling all of your vacation plans, it could be something very, very simple. Particularly if your air conditioner is still blowing out cold air. Now, if your air conditioner is blowing warm air or lukewarm air, or if you're draining something other than water, you definitely need to get a, a professional HVAC person in there immediately. But if it's just water, the first thing you wanna do is check your air filters. Lift this up. And this is on my air conditioner. Yours, of course, could be a little bit different. When you lift this up, it loosens up this little peg right here, and or it, it lets the pressure off that peg and it turns your air conditioner off. So, uh. Now, air conditioning units produce a lot of condensation, and that condensation has to get out of your house somehow. And depending on where the unit is in your house, there can that can happen in a couple of different ways. an air conditioner that's placed such that the condensation cannot drain out through the natural use of gravity, you might have one of these pumps. You're likely to have one of these pumps. So the condensation comes out of this PVC pipe here, drains into the pump, and then the pump pumps it out against gravity out to, your, out to the outside of your house. This pump or the line that's going out of your house can get clogged. And you have water dripping from all over the place up in here. All of these pipes are just dripping with water. And that's a pretty scary sight when you walk down here and see that. Now, if it's the pump that gets clogged, that's easy to fix. You just take it out and clean it. It could also be that this pump is broken, which is also a relatively inexpensive fix and probably something you could do yourself. Okay, disconnecting this thing is actually really easy. You just unplug it. There you go. You pull out this pipe, pull out this little rubber hose, I mean, and then the PVC pipe. And then you're gonna have some water spill out all over the place. You might, oh, it's a mess! <laughs> but that's how easy that is to take off and uh, I'm gonna go clean it. It's gonna be really gross. So as long as I am changing the air conditioning filter downstairs, I'm gonna change the one upstairs as well. And for us, I have to actually climb this all the way up to up there <laughs> to change it. Wish me luck. Woo, it's hot up here. Um, there, there's no pump. It has a drain pan. Uh, and when that fills up, there's a PVC pipe here that is connected. I'm not sure you're going to be able to see much back there, but it's connected back there and then it drains out the excess water all the way out to the outside of the house. That drain right there, if your air conditioner has a drain pan and there's a lot of water around it, it could also be that your drain pan has rusted through. What? I'm in the attic. Hello. Hello. How's it going? <laughs> you doing okay? This one is not nearly, it's kind of mangled, but hey! <laughs> Really? <laughs> Here, take the selfie stick for me. Okay. Got it. Okay. Taking over the channel. All right, take over the channel. It's still filming. Hi. Hey. Hi, people. Oh God. So like, like and subscribe. Let's do it.